this amazing hand came up at a Roxton Bridge weekend recently, a weekend that I run every year. And as I was explaining to my students afterwards when we discussed the hand, 6-5, come alive. You might not have very much in high card points, but you certainly have enough to join in and keep joining in. Your partner passes, East opened one week, no trump, and you're joining with two diamonds because you and your partner are playing natural, keep it simple. West bids two spades, which is a weak takeout, and it goes pass, pass, and you now show your other suit, giving your partner a chance. Partner gives preference back to diamonds, and after the three spade bid, you bid four diamonds. Very dangerous territory here because you might be pushing the opponents into a makeable four spades. The main point of the hand is how many tricks can you make after they lead a spade? Well, you have to lose a spade. Which way to take the diamond finesse? Well, East has bid the one no trump. Maybe he's got the queen of diamonds. Maybe it's doubleton. What about the glove finesse? Well, with the two way finesse, let's see what happens. They play a spade back and you trump it. You now play a diamond to the ace and a diamond from the dummy and you don't bother to finesse. You play the king and you get lucky. It's a doubles and queen. What now? We need to get to the dummy to take the club for this. So we will now play a heart over to the ace at our entry. And why have we gone over there? To take the club for this. We'll play the queen of clubs. Up pops the king. Now, just in case there's a bio club break, let's play a low club to the now promoted nine. Now, I don't like my students trumping anything, but the only way back to our hand is to trump either a spade or a heart. So let's trump to get back to our hand and just enjoy all these lovely clubs. As you can see, with the diamonds breaking 2-2 two, two, and not guessing the diamonds incorrectly, I don't blame you if you do for this ace for missing queen. You eventually made six diamonds, five clubs 11, and the ace of hearts 12. As you can see, if the opponent bid four spades, if you go five diamonds, they push you into game. And you might even be pushed into a slam if you take a phantom sacrifice, and you might get lucky and make it.